A new trend on social media is shedding light on the downfall of tipping culture. A recent study revealed that a growing number of Americans are fed up with the pressure to spend more every time they go out, sometimes even at the drive through Fox's Matthew McClellan has more. Hi, which floor? That's right, please. Okay. Uh, excuse me? TikTok has jokes. You forgot to tip. Then millions of consumers agree. It's getting absolutely outrageous. 70% of Americans say they're seeing tipping requests in more places than they used to, even at fast food chains. I was at Bojangles the other day and they asked me for a tip. We're not doing that, right? Some of that is driven by the employers, maybe not necessarily doing a great job showing that value uh, to their own staff members and putting it on the consumer. About two thirds of adults say they feel pressured to tip more. Technology is creating an environment where we feel like we are guilted. So how do we avoid this guilt? Financial advisor Celine Pastor says the easiest way is to calculate the tip yourself. And never feel like you need to be bullied. And with budgets still tight under inflation, keep gratuity in mind before you head out. So if you're going into a, a restaurant, for example, you can't just look at, you know, is this a, a $15 chicken uh, meal that I'm having, but I have to make sure that I have in my budget to add another 20% on top of that. To become a more confident tipper, know the expectations before you pay. For restaurant servers at a sit-down restaurant, plan to tip 15 to 20% with more if the service is exceptional. If you're going fast casual with counter service, two to three dollars is acceptable. For rideshare drivers, it's always 15 to 20%. For house calls like housekeeping, appliance delivery, and the exterminator, find out when you order the service if tipping is allowed. You don't have to tip, but if allowed, 10 to $20 per worker is fine. I always want to make sure that I'm showing that appreciation, but I don't want to feel like I'm having to pay part of your wages either.